Hey everybody, Norm over here. It is Guitar of the Day, and we have a very special guest. Um, and he plays with Brian Setzer, who's an old buddy of mine. And he also plays with Angela Petrelli uh, out here from time to time. And he's out here, that I think they're going to be playing at the Mint or going to the Mint tonight. And uh, I think it's going to be a cool thing. And it's my buddy over here, Yates McKendry. Hey! hey. And uh, check out this shirt for a second. Here. <laughs> it's one of my heroes, the great T-Bone Walker. One of my heroes too. And uh, one thing that's really cool about T-Bone is, you know, he was one of the most innovative blues players on the planet, and he was a uh, big influence on everybody, including BB and Absolutely. the All whole the cats world. Back in the day. Yep. Right. So let's take a look and see what's in this case here. All right. Ooh, what, what, is, what that? is that? Oh, yeah. Well, that is a beautiful 1954 Gibson ES5. Wow. It's the same guitar that T-Bone played. Um, Lowell Fulce and B.B. King also played one of these in the early, early days in the 50s. Um, it's an iconic guitar. Um, and yep. it's, uh, it's special because, you know, it has uh, three volumes and a master tone. So you can really, it's one of the most versatile guitars out there. You can get so many different tones and yep. any three really P90s. Want. Yeah, three P90 pickups. And uh, yeah, so Lowell actually played one of these Early on, he yes. actually went to a White Falcon at one point. Yes, there, he did too. in the 70s and 80s. In fact, um, years ago, uh, I backed Lowell uh, several times, you know, playing around LA. Uh, and I used to have a band with my buddy Rick Vito called the Angel City Rhythm Band. And we were like the guys they used to call to back a lot of these hey, guys. Man. Hey, Freebo, my buddy Freebo. Uh, and uh, so uh, this is a really cool guitar. And since uh, it's a big influence on Yates. Yep. I figured, Yates, who better to go out there and show this? <laughs> well, let's uh, what this pick it up does. so we can see the back yeah, and like you Absolutely. know. Let's see. Let's look at it. Yeah, it's beautiful. This. Wow. Pretty flame. Really pretty finish. The really neck. Nice stinger. Yeah. The neck is nice too. Yeah, beautiful neck. Nice flame. Yeah. So let's go take it out front and let's see All what right. this thing will do. Bring it out. Indeed. All right. All right. You're young, you're strong. Carry this thing. <laughs> <laughs> Yates McKendry over here. All right. Let's go. All right. Hey there, I'm out front with this beautiful 1954 Gibson ES5 pre, pre Switchmaster. It's uh. It's, if you look at my shirt, it's the same guitar that T-Bone Walker played, Lowell Folson, and a bunch of other greats. Um, and we're going to start with the neck pickup here. about these guitars is it has three volumes and a master tone so you can get any combination of pickups that you want to get some pretty unique cool stuff going so this is the uh, the neck in the middle position Mm -hmm. 
now here is the bridge in middle Indeed, 1954, Gibson ES-5. Great. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. Oh, sweet. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs>